In this video, we're going to learn how to take the custom shape files that we created in the previous video and turn them into custom complex line types. Again, we're going to accomplish this using Express Tools. So let's start off by coming over here and let's draw a line that will represent the line leading into the symbol. And one of the interesting things about a shape file is that you cannot snap to the shape itself. You can only snap to the intersection. So what I'm going to do for, the, for this example is I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. And I'm going to pick a point that appears to be approximately on the midpoint of this box. I'm going to turn my ortho on. And I'm going to drag out to there. Now I could snap to the insertion point. If that achieved the desired results. But in this case I would rather it be on the outside. So I'm just going to grip my line and drag it to the edge of the symbol. And I'm going to do the same thing for our circle. and go ahead and zoom my extents and zoom out a little bit more. Okay, now I'm going to go to my menu browser, go to Express, Tools, Make Line Type. I want to know where I want to save the line type file. And from right now I'm just going to save it in my, my documents because that's where it wants to go. And I'm going to call it MW-Line Type save, enter the line type name. I'm going to call this mw-square. And the description. I want to know the starting point for the line definition and I'm going to pick the end point of this line. And it wants to know the ending point and again I can't O-snap to any point on here. So I'm just going to go ahead and drag over here to approximately the end. And then it wants me to select my objects. So I'm going to select those two objects. And it tells me that MW square was created and loaded. Enter to repeat our last command. I'm going to save this definition to that same MW line type file. It's going to append it. So I'm going to tell it to yes. The line type name MW-valve the description valve line type starting point end point over there ending point and select my objects same thing for this last one Pick my points, select my objects. Okay, now let's take a look at what we have. I'm going to draw a line. And I'm going to copy it down three times. I'm going to select it. Go to my line types. Change this one to MW Circle, hit Escape, select this line, change it to MW Square, select this one, change it to MW Valve. All of these are affected by the LT scale setting, or we can override them in the Properties dialog box as well. And there you have a way to create some complex custom line types.